So this is Mabox, the mother of all open box customization. It is a wonderful Manjaro distribution with all the goodies and all the things that are important for all open box users. So let us first start. If you notice, it is an open box because we don't have a desktop where you can place the desktop icons. Of course, you have this beautiful wallpaper which we will change we have two conky which are very important the first one on the left is very important in order to know some key bindings but later on in let's say one month of usage you can remove it because you would know all the key bindings and the right one which give us all the information in the front here if i right click I will get the menu. This menu is not the default open box menu, but it is a customizable menu known as JG menu. Many distributions nowadays for open box, they are improving their menu by utilizing this menu. Why? Because it is has only one thing that is important for it, which is it has an extra search button. So let's say I want to change the wallpaper, I directly press wall, so I get the wallpaper, I enter, and instead of searching, I directly, in, uh, instead of navigating the menu, I can directly search. Look how many wallpapers they have. It is a very polished open box distribution. So we have now this beautiful wallpaper. Let us go on the right side. So here on the right side, we have the date. The CPU is 9, 10%, which should be one or two. I don't know what is happening extra here. For the RAM, it is 295. I don't think it is 295. It should be much higher. For the disk, six gigabytes for open box. And when you will see also that there is not much software installed. You might have some uh, browser, no library office, no wine, no extra programs that take, but of course there is for customization for the icons. We have the Mapbox Linux 2201. When you go to download it, you, you will get the latest one without much updates. That's why I installed this one and directly you will get maybe around sometimes zero updates because it is the latest one, the ISO. Looking at the kernel, they have the long-term release. You can, you have the option to install the latest one, but for open box, it's good to have this long-term release 5.10. So it is Arch. There is no updates. The installed packages is 922, and of course the branch is stable. So we talked about this one. We talked about this menu. It is a simple menu here. And we have up there, we have the thin to panel. As with all, everything here in this Mabox, everything is extremely hackable and customizable. Although thin to is hackable, they are using extra tools to customize it. As an example, if you go over this button, it says, if I press the left mouse button, it will give me the main menu, which is the menu here when you right click. And if you right click, it will give me the settings menu. So if I right click, it gives me a setting menu here. And if I left click, you will get this, uh, this general G JG menu. That's what, what I am talking about. The other one, let's say, is one is left click show desktop the middle one if you press the middle the key button middle wheel it will switch desktops and the right right mouse it will give the window list same here for the file manager they have two terminals if you left click you get one terminal and if you right click you'll get another terminal let me exit this one and we have this terminal it's a good idea to include and here if I left click it will open the browser and let me right click 
when you right click it give me a menu if I want doesn't doesn't like Firefox I can install these very clever thing to include here the left and the right menu looking here I think these three are useless because they are included in the conkey I don't know why he included them they will increase more more uh, resources and more usage of course the battery the network manager the updates and here if you notice here if you left click there is a screenshot tool and right click you have another application which is the flame shot flame shot is a wonderful screen capture one of the features of screen flame shot is you if you can pin it here so you can have another uh, another one you can include here and you can it is very nice uh, addition this flame shot other than screenshotting so we looked here and the notable thing is that they have one arrow here and one arrow here if menus are not enough for you okay they will include they included another two extra menus so this is the distribution of menus so you press this one you will get a panel or a menu and some of them are basically useless but they include them also the quick navigation all of these you can do it in the, the file manager all of these if you want to go to pictures you open file manager here this one is very important for the commands so it gives you all the key bindings so if you want to change the key bindings without going to the open box key bindings uh, rc.xml you directly change them from here it's called mb helper.csv you can change them we go quick a wallpaper screen locker system information this is a pipe menu open box is known for its pipe menu this this pipe menu it give me all the information that is in the conkey so it's useful information but if you have a conkey why should you use this one tint to panel if you want the tint to to be down let's say i want to configure it here let me configure it okay so here the panel it is here on top if I want it on the bottom I apply so it is down we finished it let me close let us continue here so we have the tint 2 panel the conkey settings if I want to choose the conkey you notice we have two conkey if let's say I I don't want this to be shown anymore I go down to the shortcuts here there are themes for the shortcuts uh, conkey if I want I will uncheck it and click apply and the left one will be gone and we are left with the right one the other thing with the left panel is that there is a color menu search LX task B top instead of H top and if we open the B top if you notice here they are giving us the conkey is giving a RAM of 362 and here they are giving us the user there is around 600 megabytes of ram usage so that's what i was talking about it's not a light open box uh, distribution and that's it for there's the weather forecast and that's it for the left panel let's look for the right panel the right panel there is the mabox control center this is the biggest file that you can use it has everything you need so you can remove all of these panels and keep this one this is the most important one if you look here you can change the kernel from here if you press it you can install the latest version user accounts hardware if you want the resolution new fetch also if you want to go to the specs of the of the computer the software you have add remove software which is the pamac which is a gui very good welcome here the auto start they have two options you can use the xdg auto start or the open box auto start instead of going to the file manager you can directly go to here and you can add the programs that you have of course they have here the nitrogen the tint 2 they load the tint 2 they load the the wallpaper and pc man of m as a daemon so it will be directly faster to load etc and you can add your own 
commands. Look and feel is the open box configuration manager, but most of them they are removed, especially the menus and all of this. So, but you can tweak some of the windows that they are using. There is also the tint to setting. You can use this one or you can use this one, the same thing. If you want to choose the tint to or you co would configure this tint to to put it up or you want to add some buttons, you can use this one. For the conkey, there is the same thing which you can change. That's why I told you that this one is better than the two panels because it has everything in it. The menu panels, if you want to tweak the left pen panel and the right panel, you can tweak them here. Amazing. So you can change whatever you want, put whatever you want on the top and the bottom and the favorites and the below. It's a complete system you can change. It will be a different system if you go here and start tweaking inside and hacking all of the panels that you saw on here. The compositor, the PyCom compositor is, you can configure it also. The themes, uh, they have a lot of themes, so you can change whatever you want. So look how many themes you have and the images, so you can choose which one that you like. Let's uh, skip them like, like this. Let us continue with the panel. So we have the system and hardware, the updates, the mirrors, there is a very big guide for Mabox, but people are not reading anymore, but you can read many of the features, especially how to hack your left and right panel. And these are the logout and the login screen. This finishes the right panel. In the end, Manjaro open box or Mabox is one of the best open box customization distribution ever it has everything from customizing the panels the menus the themes the windows the compositors the conkey everything is included here and if you are an open box fan this is the distribution that you need to download in order to get all the tricks and all the hacking which is involved in order to make you more productive in your distribution. Thank you.